welcome to Costa Rica. I'm Christina and I'm here to introduce Christopher Gardner. Hello, Christina. Christopher is a natural builder who specializes in building star domes and earth building techniques. And this summer we are going to be in Sintra, Portugal at Terra Alta, where Christopher will be leading a workshop uh, on how to build a star dome. Christopher, would you like to tell us about star domes? Absolutely. The Star Dome is a newer version of Buckminster Fuller's geodesic dome. Basically, a Star Dome uses the sacred geometry positioning of pentagons to place bamboo struts in a very specific configuration where we load it under tension to build a skeleton that's monolithic. And then we can cover this in any way that we want. That's beautiful. So there are many advantages in using this uh, dome model regarding other dome models, right? Yes, I would say the main advantage is the fact that it takes very little carpentry skills. Uh, with other types of geodesic domes, you have to be a, a very skilled person with cutting wood and you have to know how to mount all the, those pieces of wood together. With a star dome, all you have to do is cut 15 equal length members, position them correctly, bend it and put it under tension, and then you have your structure. That's beautiful and amazing. So does one require any specific training to attend this workshop? No, in fact, you can be completely, completely new to this. And within three days, you'll have all the basics that you need to be able to build this structure. Also, the other technologies that we're going to be putting into this structure can also be learned. We're going to be learning how to do the foundation for drainage, which is a French drain system. We're also going to be learning Wallow and Daub, which our stem wall, which is the wall that's going to go underneath this, is a very old technique. It's tried and true, especially in Europe. Then we're going to be learning the cob technique that's going to fill in these gaps all around the dome. And then we're going to weatherproof the entire dome with the newest, most sustainable way to use cement. In fact, we're going to use so little cement, it's not even worth talking about. But what we're going to do is we're going to weatherproof the entire shell of this with what's called ferro cement or nylon cement. Well, that's great. Thank you so much for your explanation and really looking forward to see you in Portugal and build a star dome together, hopefully with all of you. Wonderful. I'm looking forward to it also. See you in Portugal.